What's up, guys? Welcome back. Some more glorious, mate. What am I doing? Oh, yes. Hard editor. Let me pull this up a little bit. There we go. Always gets a little bit of lag when you do that. Alright, so for that's pretty good. If you don't edit your HUD, you really should. You can kind of, you can fade things, you can take away things. So basically what I have to do is you kind of like clean up the uh, the screen and put everything in the bottom right so it's out of the way. <laughs> it kind of works for me. Sometimes I even feel it like putting the fucking build to the bottom left or to the bottom right, but then you guys don't see that, so I don't. And it was a good idea to like bring the map down a little bit, because you you should be looking at the middle of the screen, because that's where it goes. But you need to keep an eye on the map at all times, so I don't know. I feel like, I feel it's kind of perfect. Then anyway, we're playing Hades, which is a request. I went for Warlocks uh, first. Warlocks rush. I'm not sure if that's good or not. Uh, Gubis beats me level one, but if I don't fall behind, I eventually catch up. And I think I can deal with him because I can two his his ability that I can't remember what it is. I think it's his one. Potentially taking ticks of damage, so the minions will hit him. And he hit level first. Like I said, he does out clear me. So that's just something we need to work with. But eventually I will catch back up. Because we've also got clear. It's just uh, his level 1 is stronger. So the idea is not to fall behind at level 1. I thought he had the stun. He did not. I thought he did. He did not. That is unfortunate. Lag. I did not notice any lag. Yeah, he's kind of falling back. He does have lag, so... I'm not really confident right now, because I don't trust this rat. I'm more confident at 1v1 tonight, because I believe in myself. And I don't believe in him. In the slightest, two mana pots, we do have a heal on our three, so I feel that's fine. Uh, our Rattas was quite low there. Daji was quite low, but she might have healed back up. We probably should be a little bit behind. No, what? They must not have their red buff yet. No, they do. See, that's what I can do. Mm, but I missed the minions to do that. I still feel that was worth. Actually, maybe it wasn't. Think about it, maybe it wasn't. But if I can get the 1-3 properly, we should be alright. His ult does out trade mine. Something to keep in mind. So, we need to be careful with that. We just used our clear as well. He saw us, so we can fall back a little bit. He's got life still as well. Yeah, just a little bit though. Pretty good. Right, so we can nearly get full Warlocks. We've still got one mana pot left. So this, this is kind of looking alright. He will hit 5 slightly before us because he got the left salt himself, the left mid. So he'll hit 5 first. We do have bees, but it doesn't mark, so slow as fuck. And although we can't ult his ult, his ult wins. <laughs> his ult wins, essentially. I'm not going to use my. Uh... I'm not going to use my 1 just in case the issue shows up and I just die. See, we can do that. If I hot 5, this would have been a kill, I think. Because he's not 5. So, is he 5 yet? He will hit 5 off this way, he should. Yeah, but he's out of mana, so you'll have to go back to base. Yeah. Yeah. But he's going to miss an entire wave. Or most of the wave. And we're just going to head back to base now. We'll still get the credit. Yes. We still get the back. So that works out perfectly for us. We get our full Warlock Sash. Hades is slow as fuck, guys. Something to keep in mind. I'll probably get Blink. Beads and Blink is really good. However, with a Gubis, the check out, you kind of want Aegis, but I feel like if you're Hades, you kind of need Blink because you really want to Blink on people. Especially when there's a Gubis. Gubis is like so easy. Sylvanas is so easy. Even Kronos without his ult is actually pretty easy to ult. They're actually good matchups for Hades. It's just our early game's a bit janky because we're slow as fuck and don't have boots because. Warlocks is life, man. He's level 4 with full boost as a kill potential. That's kind of why I don't like Warlocks. Because there's so much kill potential in the early game against certain gods. Because Hades is really matchup depend. If you get a good matchup, you can win so hard. But... 
You might be fucking yourself because you really need to get kills if you don't go Warlocks. Because Warlocks is so good. So he's going to ult his back. Now he's going to beat Sarah. Okay, that's fine. That actually, I think, is to our benefit because it means our ult will come before his beats. And he will have his ult, so he can ult our ult still if he so desires. But I'm not really too concerned about that. Yeah. We ain't got extra farm there, though, so that's not bad. Remember, he does have his ult, so we need to be careful. I'm gonna let the wave come in. The no point in taking a risk when we don't have to. Because then if, if we do come out and he does wrap us, we do need to beat this way. We get to keep beats just by losing a few minions. Obviously, we may never need the beats, but it's better to have them and not need them. And lose a minion than to just get a minion, fuck your beats away, and get fucked later on. I do have it on instant cast. I kind of know the range of it. Kind of. Sorry. There's something to say sorry there. Have called. I thought he was at his red, but my red's not up, so his red's probably not up, so that's kind of bad. He got a good gank, and he's bootless as well, so he rotated slow as fuck to get that kill. Almost certainly used his ult. Mm, they've been pulled apart by the Geb. That's unfortunate. Oh my god, I tried to ult there, it can animation cancelled by the 3. That is unfortunate. It was a pretty decent play, but it kind of got cancelled. I could have beats, but I didn't want to. Again, we're just holding those beats, man. Holding those beats. We can take our last mana pot. We can stick around for a little bit longer. We can possibly, possibly get to full boots before we're back. Kill down boots, by the way, as well. We're still a little bit more gold to Left, meds are about to come up. My boy Tommy, the oldest mate player I know, grinding away to fucking gold for like a legend. I think he's 32. Which isn't that old, you know. I'll admit that. Makes him old when you're a fucking little kid at 15, but it's not that old. Beat. If she ults. Idiot. If she also could have beat that, that would, I, don't, I don't know what the fuck that was, that was pure greed. But it gave us the gold, so I appreciate that. Thank you, Daji. Kill them bits. I got some words. See these items that are recommended? You know, this and maybe this. These two are good. I'd probably get these two items. I'm probably going to get a Divine Rune as well. So, we get both of these Divine Rune, and then we can either get Discord, Lifesteal. Or it's pretty bad, I guess. We don't always need the Vine Rune, but in this case we do. Hopefully that makes sense to everyone. You kinda want to build to deal damage, so you want pen. But you also want to be able to take damage because you're gonna be a melee range ulting people, standing still, you're basically a giant fucking target, nice kill and left. Your right tower is under attack. Maybe not. Yeah. Kind of here for this. Well, I showed up, got credit for one, and took an assist. I will take that. I earned nothing, but I will take that. Big Hades. Once you get boots, people. Once you get boots, you start to feel pretty good. What about to get alt? That's his alt. Wait for it. 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 Got it. He's got beats and shell. Because of course he does. Why, why, why wouldn't he have beats and shell? Why wouldn't he have beats and shell? No, that's that's reasonable. I don't, I don't want fucking kills. Kills are fucking overrated, man. But we got his beats and we got his shell. So, I mean, it's pretty good. Not his shell, we got a shell. We can grab the wave. We're looking pretty good, actually. We're level 10 to his level 9. It's a small... Lead, but it's a lead nonetheless. Good popper. I, pop. I want to try and stay till 1350 for stage 2 of Void Shield. It's kind of what I want. 
Boom! You like that, didn't you, bitch? Wasted like a fucker, though. That's why we need the Vine Rune. I thought it was a kill, it wasn't. He did get a good 3 off. He did force our beads, but I thought I would get the kill. I didn't. I thought I, I, thought I would, though. I believed. I believed I might potentially get that kill. And I failed. But there's a lot of neutral farm. What are the junglers doing, man? This, this, I'm not expecting this. This is obviously a low level game. She's. Look at herself. Jesus. Hey, you sold. You get straight up sold. So we're gonna go back to base now. We can get. Oh my god, what a cunt. What a fucking cunt. I didn't even care if I get killed. There's, there is no kill here for her. Like, okay, okay, no. That was that was different. I might have mana as well. So we will stay for one more wave because that will take us up. I think. Yeah, we can get we can get this over one more wave. We can get blink as well. Let's head back to base. So we're looking pretty good. We can get full void stun. Gives a lot of pain. We're gonna do a blink. God, I might end up regretting this because Aegis is so good against Gubis. Yeah. What is it we say, boys? Go big or go fucking home, man. The only way I go home is through death. Which is technically my home because I'm fucking headies. So we're 69. So we're actually a thousand up. So that's pretty nice. On the jungler, we're over a thousand up. Me and our jungler are really fed, so that's pretty good. That was his beads. I missed. So you got his out. That way our rat knows and we can make a play on that. I've got blink up as well, so like I can blink in on him. Although I would like to get my red buff first. This will make her this will make your place a little bit stronger. But they may still get something, because we're at something there and give us a quite low with no beats in the well. And you gotta kill. We kind of assisted for that, unofficially. Because again, we got the beads and out. We'll go clean up the tower. We'll be quite happy. I think Achilles is it as well. Okay. Do you know what? Something I've noticed there's not a lot of Achilles we've seen, but every time I see him play, he looks broken. I don't know why people don't play him. Unless they're not playing him, because. What the fuck? That was stupid. What the fuck was that all about? What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> you can't fight me, you're miles behind. Cool. Oh, oh, this is your Hades. 30 minute or man. I don't blame him for DC, uh, F6, not DC, F6, not the Daiji was fucking horrendous. I don't know what the fuck she was doing. But I think we played that quite well. So I would have got Divine Rune that game. Chak, Sylvanas, Gubis, and Kronos as well. All life stealing. In fact, the Kronos was doing quite well. Uh, maybe they just thought they, they couldn't carry Daji. Uh, maybe maybe that was a bit too preemptive. We're fair enough. We're four K up. Four K up at thirty minutes is a lot. To be fair, it is, it is quite a decent. It is quite a decent lead. The Daiji was really far behind, the Savannah was really far behind. Uh, even the Gubis has got a decent KD and shit, Steel was behind me. And a lot of gold with me, 1500. Like, it, is, it is a lot to be behind. Yeah. Only really Kronos was doing well for them. So maybe they could actually have won because I'm not going to push towers very well. But it's a lot of pressure on Kronos and Kronos is kind of easy for us. So yeah, I'd have got Divine Rune. Definitely. Because it's free healers. That gives us more f uh, flat pen to go with this flat pen. And then, 
no, normally I would get breastplate, but actually looking at it a bit more at their team comp and what they've got, I probably wouldn't. I probably would have just got Divine Rune Discord in this game. Because they are 10% CDs as well. And then either Lifesteal, like a Bancrofts or a Typhons, or even Pythags, or I would have got Spear of Desolation, which gives us another 10% CDR, which would take us up to 30%, and gives us more pin, which would give us true damage against uh, everyone without magic defense. Obviously, we don't have Lifesteal, but with anti heal and lots of pen, our damage would still probably outtrade most of them, especially for lead. And then just get the pot, and that takes you up to forty percent CDs. So that's kind of how I would do Hades there. It's not, it's not like that every game, but in that particular game, I would have done it. He fully shaded a lot of damage. So yeah, a bit short, but you know what? This is Smite. People have sex all the time. That's some Hades, but I do like Hades. I do rate him. I do enjoy playing him. We've got a diamond. So guys, also enjoy. Thanks for watching. As always, see you all next time.